My name is Kevin Z. I am founder and CEO of My Wi-Fi Networks. What I'm going to talk about today is the opportunity with social Wi-Fi marketing for you and your business, how social Wi-Fi marketing works and why you need to use it and your clients need to use it. I'll talk about the different integrations and marketing automations that our proprietary software has. I'll talk about the hardware compatibility and how to install this from anything from a local business to a large stadium. We'll do a platform demo. I'll dive into the, to the platform and show you how easy it is to build campaigns and view all the analytics that you'll capture from your audience. We'll go into some business models, ways to make money, and an $80,000 case study that one of our clients did. And I first want to tell you who we are and what we do. So my Wi-Fi networks transform existing wireless networks into a free Wi-Fi with social connect experience. That helps you collect valuable consumer data, capture visitor metrics, and automate proximity marketing campaigns. We have a white label platform that really allows you to create new revenue channels, monetize existing or new opportunities, and seamlessly integrate this with existing Wi-Fi hardware. Today, we have over 2,000 white label resellers in 24 countries around the world, which is a snapshot of where they're located. These are also real numbers of the amount of leads that some of them have collected. 54,000 Facebook profiles, 120,000 email profiles. This is real data, and these are some of the campaigns that they've run in different areas all over the world. As you can see, it's very customizable. It fits your client, fits your brand. And I really first wanted to tell you why you should focus on Wi-Fi marketing. What is the opportunity and why you should shift some gears and turn in this direction? Well, if you're noticing, are you guys, let me ask you actually on the call here, are you noticing more of these signs in and around local businesses and franchises and stadiums where you go. I mean, people are addicted to their devices. Uh, people use it all the time. And I personally see this literally everywhere I go. These are just some snapshots that I've taken myself, some pictures, and you know, they even offer the SSID and the password for people to log in. I mean, everyone is now starting to offer Wi-Fi, so much so that Facebook even added a Wi-Fi finder. So a little tool now built into the Facebook app where you can search for free Wi-Fi hotspots around you. And Facebook is now literally driving traffic into local businesses. Now the problem with today's Wi-Fi is that it's typically locked by passwords. It needs complicated vouchers. It has a very confusing sign-in process. It's insecure and unprotected. And it really doesn't add value to the business owner. I mean, businesses don't want to offer Wi-Fi because they get nothing in return. Now everyone is talking about the importance of free Wi-Fi. I mean, these are real articles and Business Insider, Small Business Friends, and Forbes talking about how businesses can boost profits. You know, there's huge benefits to offering Wi-Fi and it impacts customer satisfaction. I mean, local businesses need it more than ever because number one, Wi-Fi is already being used. 75% of smartphone owners connect to Wi-Fi on their devices. It drives decisions. Three out of four consumers say that Wi-Fi availability affects their purchase decisions. Customers crave Wi-Fi along with their devices. 65% of people make restaurant decisions based on Wi-Fi, and 94% say that it's most important amenity at a hotel. It's now taking over the free buffet. It also increases spend. 50% of small businesses in the U.S. said that customers spend more money when free Wi-Fi became available. I mean, these are huge reasons why any local business should offer it. And where is it used most? Typically, it's used most where businesses have repeat customers, such as restaurants, cafes, retail salons, movie theaters. People come back often. Businesses with long customer wait times, such as auto dealers, repair shops, dentists, doctors, laundromats. And businesses with extended customer stays, such as hotels, parks, stadiums, museums, and campgrounds. And when you think about all the places where Wi-Fi is offered, looking at the U.S. alone, there's over 10 million businesses, plus another 26 million other small business locations that currently offer Wi-Fi and are potential clients of yours. And we see businesses obviously see Wi-Fi is very important. You know, the big guys, the McDonald's and Starbucks offer it. Even the gap now is understanding the importance of free Wi-Fi and they're starting to now include an opt-in to Wi-Fi at their stores, but they're still getting it wrong. And that's where we come in. So let me show you a very quick, but one minute video that helps explain social Wi-Fi marketing and why it's so important for local businesses. Many establishments offer free Wi-Fi for different reasons. Attracting new customers, keep them happy, and maybe because everyone else is doing it. But let's face it, free Wi-Fi sucks. Complicated passwords, slow connections, and worst of all, you get nothing in return. But all this is about to change with social-powered Wi-Fi hotspots. It's still the free Wi-Fi your customers expect, but without the hassles and lack of results. It's now possible for customers to simply connect to your free Wi-Fi service using their favorite social media account. Once they've logged in with just a few clicks, 
you will be able to get their social media details, email addresses, and more, allowing you to build long-lasting and valuable relationships beyond a single visit. Now you can send your customers mobile coupons, exclusive offers, email newsletters, and timely promotions long after they have visited your store. Grow your business and keep your customers happy with the new magical way to offer free Wi-Fi. Contact us to get your own social-powered Wi-Fi hotspot today. So I want you to think connect with Facebook. How many times have you used connect with Facebook to register for a website before? So instead of entering your first name, last name, email, and filling out a very annoying form, you click connect with Facebook and your form is pre-filled. So it's the same idea, but we now do that for free Wi-Fi, anywhere free Wi-Fi is available. So in a way, we help bring the online and offline world together using this technology. So step number one, a customer, as they normally would, would open their phone or device and look for a free Wi-Fi hotspot. They then would see a pop-up landing page, which is completely customized with the logo and brand and look and feel of that business and allows the customer to log in, connect with Facebook the same way that you do with any normal website. Now, the big thing to get right away is that the reason we use social media to log in is, first of all, to make it easy and quick, but second is because we are getting a valid email address. And you marketers out there know how important a valid email address is when it comes to doing uh, retention or any kind of marketing for your clients. And we're also leveraging the popularity of social media at physical locations. So we're looking at 2 billion Facebook users, 200 million LinkedIn users, 330 million Twitter, 700, you know, I can keep going. There's, this is the easiest way to opt in with promotions to go where they live and get valid email addresses of engaged users. And even with Facebook Messenger, there's 1.2 billion users on Messenger. There's 65 million businesses using it. Uh, and this is a huge channel to, to now leverage. So once that user selects their social media login of choice and log in, they then get engaged. You can do things like redirect them to an app store to download an app. You can also redirect them to a uh, review site to leave a review for the business or retarget them after the fact. There's multiple campaigns and multiple objectives all designed to meet exactly what your client's looking to achieve. Uh, we make it very easy to launch any of these objectives, some surveys, lead gen, coupons, and social sharing. Now, the huge thing that our platform does at the very end is that once that user connects, that information is shared, we can then engage them with multiple different channels. So for example, if I was logging in with Twitter, I would find my hotspot over here, I would get my automatic pop-up, I would agree to the terms, I click on connect with Twitter, it would automatically open up my account. All I had to do was click on authorize, I then get redirected back to my objective here, I can share things, for example, my advertiser here is Coca-Cola, and it will go right to their promotion big thing about our platform is that you can custom brand this app. So you can use your own app, so you can customize everything from a cloud control panel. The entire experience can be customized in the cloud. You can use Facebook login. And those who use SMS, where you do any kind of SMS marketing, you can also use a phone number to log in where you get a legal double opt-in and then grant access via SMS. I also mentioned Facebook Messenger. We just launched this new option to connect with Facebook Messenger, allowing anyone at a local business to log in using Facebook Messenger and then engage a chatbot. So chatbots is the new rage where you literally have a robot speaking to your clients, profiling your clients, doing surveys, selling items. You can now engage and drive traffic and start conversations all via Facebook logins. And once all this data is captured, you track all of this data right in your own dashboard. You get the real-time analytics, all the visual reports as you see here and a whole bunch more. You can export and sync all the data with your external databases. You can identify customer habits very easily. You can customize all your campaigns and you can set up automations all within your own branded dashboard. And it allows you to very easily measure the on-site and post-visit engagement. For example, customers from anywhere from a coffee shop to a large stadium could then get profiled, engaged, you grab their email, add them to custom audiences, match them to existing networks and more. So for example, anyone who does Facebook audiences or any ads on Facebook, you're now creating a actual visitor Facebook audience where you're now literally tracking those who have physically been to a location, used the Wi-Fi and now targeting them. And through the Facebook audience network, you can target those active Wi-Fi Facebook users and their friends. And the cool thing here is that you can also track if any of your retargeted ads have worked. If anyone comes back to use the Wi-Fi on location and log in with Facebook, 
you can then use an offline conversion to match the person who saw the ad to the person who physically uses the Wi-Fi at location within 62 days. This is a brand new feature that Facebook has launched and we've already integrated a way to be able to track the offline conversions if your ads are working. So those who work with clients and do any kind of Facebook ad marketing, there's no better way than showing the clients your value than providing real reports of, hey, we found similar audiences to your Facebook Wi-Fi users. We brought them in and here's exactly how that conversion worked. Let's talk about the integrations and automation. So once you get all the data and you capture all this valuable data, what can you later do with that data? Now, we specialize, our platform specializes in Wi-Fi marketing automation. Now, what does that mean? It allows you to, number one, integrate your own social and payment login apps. So you don't use our apps, you literally add your own profiles for Facebook, Facebook Messenger, Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram, vContact in Russia, email, SMS, Twilio, credit card through Stripe, PayPal, and even a custom bypass option. You can add all of these for your own business and individual ones for all of your clients. So you can actually add all of your client accounts to your white label dashboard as well. And once everything is all connected, you can send this data to any third party service of your choice. So we have a deep integration with a lot of the major CRMs and email providers, including Zapier with custom templates. So here it makes it very easy for you to take all the data you're capturing on a client by client level, connect all the data to multiple accounts. And jumping right into the platform itself, it is a 100% white label captive portal. For those who don't know the terminology captive portal, it is that pop-up that comes up when you try to connect to Wi-Fi, it's the one that asks you to authorize. So what we do is act as a layer, as a custom captive portal that works with any existing hardware and everything is in the cloud. So you can customize the branding, the domains, the SSL certificates and sub-user logins and people will literally think this is your platform when it really is all managed by us. There's over 20 supported languages in our platform and this works anywhere in the world. Uh, it is your own Wi-Fi marketing software as a service. As I mentioned, you customize your logo, colors, SSL, but you also allow your clients to create their own campaigns. We have a very easy to use campaign builder. It allows you to create your campaigns. You choose your social login options. You upload your logo. It's very easy to do. You can change some settings like your background color, your language, your opacity, all kinds of look and feel. Uh, and then from the technical side, you can also customize your thank you page put Facebook boxes, redirect to different app stores, and do all of this directly within the dashboard. So you can view all the analytics right from within the dashboard. Here's just a couple of views of the kind of data that you get back from your connected users. These are all real time. These are all physical, real time Wi-Fi users. And then when you look at the profile history and take a look at the kind of data you're capturing, and we have the customer's Facebook profile, their wallpaper, their real email address that I blurred out for privacy reasons here. You also get their gender, their age, when they connected, how long they connected, how long they spent. When it comes to integrating marketing automation tools, Infusionsoft, very easy, you click on connect, it's all connected, you then use that. When somebody connects, disconnects on a certain delay, it's very easy to use. And you see everything listed right within our dashboard. Our built-in ad server makes it easy to monetize this with your own tags, with other tags through our platform. And you can also have sub-users who then are managed with their own permissions and can change and not change whatever you want to allow them to do at any time. Our platform also allows you to remotely manage your network. So it monitors all the device statuses, allows you to change the SSID and capture all this information from the cloud. For example, you can see if the device needs a firmware upgrade and upgrade it remotely. You can limit the bandwidth per user. This also works great if you have working with a slow internet connection, you can limit how much people can actually use. You can also limit the session time, which also works great to limit how long somebody can physically use the Wi-Fi for per day. And we also have a content filter to allow you to block the content of sensitive information. If it's a family restaurant or a church, you don't wanna have people having open reign to the Wi-Fi. This is also legally required in most states. So let's talk about a live demo. Let me just quickly jump over to the platform. I'm gonna just show you some real live stats of some of the network activity that we have. Again, these are all real, this is all real data, all real time, this is not made up stuff. This is where we have uh, just one of our partners listed with some of their clients and how many people that have connected on Facebook, Twitter, uh, LinkedIn, Instagram, et cetera. So here, these are real numbers over here. We're talking about 55,000 Facebook users. Uh, over here, we have 122,000 emails. Here are some, you know, some locations around the world. We have the men versus women breakdown. We have information about clients. Uh, as you see, we get all kinds of great information, real username, Mac address, device type, Android, mobile phone. Just quickly jumping here, we also have a timeline. This is a real live view in real time. I see this person connected one minute ago, also one, all within one minute ago. 
I mean, check out some of the activity that we have in these hotspots. And the cool thing is that once you have uh, this set up, we also have different views that you can give your client access to, to view all these reports in real time. It's really nice to see over here, for example, there's 121 pages of 10, so tons of, of leads getting generated here. This is all in real time. You can view a dashboard to see the activity, exactly of how users are coming, who's new, who's returning, Facebook versus custom. Just, this is just great stuff that you can then take and give your client access to. And I'll go through in a minute the different business models that you can use to monetize this. But just at a glance, the way that you can use this platform to sell is pretty amazing. So let's talk about our technology stack. It is hosted with Amazon Web Services. It's a secure cloud hosted platform. It's all a service oriented architecture. So we actually have a bunch of different microservices working at the same time. So nothing will ever go down. Uh, if something breaks, it will be easily replaced because it's all automated. It's region distributed. It has elastic load balancing. For those who are not technical, uh, long story short, this will make sure that the platform never goes down, it works fast, and it works anywhere in the world. We have distributed regions that offer this no matter where you are in the world. The majority of apps like Instagram, etc., are hosted on Amazon. So rest assured that this platform will work fast and anywhere in the world. So when it comes to installing this, you might be thinking, how do I install this at a local business or a large stadium? Is it difficult? How does it work? So there are different, a couple different ways uh, that these are installed. They're installed at small locations and large locations. The small locations use hotspots, which I'll go for in a minute. And the large locations can integrate with major cloud controllers and existing hardware that is required for large volume traffic. So when you talk about the small business, we have what's called a social powered Wi-Fi hotspot, a plug and play hotspot that plugs into any existing internet connection. It's all cloud managed. So once you plug it in, it's set and forget. You can actually change anything you want from the cloud and the customers can then connect to that Wi-Fi hotspot. It is secure. You plug it into your existing modem and you are good to go. Now, if you're working with a business that has an existing internet connection, let's say they have an existing Wi-Fi hotspot, you don't have to replace that. What you would do is you would add on this new social powered hotspot on location. You can buy them from us for $50 or you can buy similar ones on Amazon for 25 bucks. They're very cost effective. And you can also integrate this with existing hardware. And now the business will actually have two access points and this works for a few reasons. Number one, the existing one, you want to lock down, change the password and keep it for private staff only. You should never have public people using a private network. So make sure that existing hotspot that they have is turned private. And then this new one that's made for public use that has the DNS filter, has the social login, all the protection, all that good stuff. This way, all the existing internet connection remains private and the new public network is deployed by you, which is now all plug and play. These hotspots, as I mentioned, are all unbranded. So even if you look at the back, it says social powered Wi-Fi hotspot. You can put your own company brand or sticker right on that. We sell them for 50 bucks. You can use it, sell it for a lot more and deploy these all plug and play that has the firmware already installed. Uh, and it also auto updates from the cloud. So there's really nothing you ever have to do with these things other than just plug them in. Like I mentioned, we also have hardware compatibility with some cost effective solutions from Amazon. This one is $24.99. It has prime next day delivery. We've actually developed a cloud firmware that we give you at no charge to mod these. It takes about five minutes to do. And then once they're good, they can also be managed and updated by us from the cloud. Now, if you're working with existing larger networks, and I'm talking even larger retail stores, major stadiums, hotels, any kind of large installs, you can also integrate and layer over our technology on top of existing networks. So we have native cloud controller integrations. Now, what is a cloud controller? Anytime you have access points that are from Cisco, Cradlepoint, OpenMesh, Ubiquity, or really any of the major providers, they are all managed from the cloud. Controllers that make sure the access point is online, who's on it, how many people are using it, is the security all good, they're all remotely controlled. So we've built custom integrations that seamlessly connect by Wi-Fi networks to these cloud controllers to allow you to deploy this technology on top of existing networks without using additional hardware and without using additional firmware. So that's a big thing to remember. You don't need additional hardware or firmware if you connect with a native cloud controller integration. And we now work with most of the major cloud controller integrations in the marketplace. How to monetize this, how to make money and uh, different business models that you can use. There are multiple ways, ad networks, done for you solutions, DIY solutions, reseller services. You can resell the software itself. You could deploy this at large events and festivals and charge on a per event basis. You can build your own network and ad monetize it. You can build retargeting lists and you can upsell services. So really some of the bigger areas in the social Wi-Fi partner markets are retail franchises, marketing agencies, large event venues, and internet service providers. By linking up with these companies, 
it's very easy to deploy it because they are already deploying Wi-Fi today. If you do anything with local marketing, and this includes PPC or social media generation or Facebook ad selling, if you're a video marketer or reputation marketer, if you sell mobile websites or apps, or you do any kind of affiliate e-com or, or any kind of affiliate marketing, you can very easily drive traffic and drive sales and upsell all of your services by using Wi-Fi as a fire starter. Because Wi-Fi helps you capture incredible data. You get emails, custom audiences, you get phone numbers and you can engage messenger chat. So when you think about it, think about all the things you can sell based on this data that you now are capturing from your clients and have available to you in your custom dashboard. If you wanted to do a done for you model where for example, your clients don't know this dashboard exists and the whole platform doesn't exist to them, you're selling a much more expensive white glove service, that's a great business model. But if you want to scale your business, you can also offer a DIY, which is a do-it-yourself model where you literally create a sub-account to your clients and let them create and manage their own accounts. By doing that, you can remotely from anywhere in the world bring on clients and let them manage exactly how they market to their clients over their Wi-Fi networks. This is a proven business model. Now, don't just take it from me. Uh, Turnstile, for example, charges $3,000 a year for the basic service, the very basic stuff of what I just showed you. And Yelp just bought the company Turnstile for $20 million. So Yelp is about to get into this game. If that's a sign to you that Wi-Fi marketing is about to be a very big thing in local. And you can offer something to the clients that people can't. Well, number one, everyone hates Yelp. And number two, you are a local marketing professional. So you can offer that local expertise, that hands-on marketing that Yelp can't. And you can also beat them in price with what I'm about to share with you in the package that you're about to have. And also Zenreach, another company that does something very similar to what we have, they charge clients starting, basic packages starting at $400 a month. Uh, they've raised now a total of $80 million from the likes of Ashton Kutcher, Kevin Durant. These are some famous people now getting on board and seeing the value of Wi-Fi marketing. You can literally create a Zenreach competitor overnight. Now, by leveraging this, you can not only sell to local businesses and get them to pay you, to install this and generate leads for them, you can also build your own branded Wi-Fi network. So you can monetize free hotspots by offering this for free to a local business or to local populated areas and then monetizing the traffic. Because we have an integrated ad server with the zones and the real-time reports, you can easily segment the different types of hotspots that you have on your network. You can also tap into existing access points. So if you know any networks or see Meraki on the wall, see Cisco on the wall, you can call that business and say, hey, look, are you guys monetizing your access points? Because if you're not, here's a way that I can help. You can also target banner and interstitial placements. So you can drop banners, either videos or ad banners, generate more revenue. We also have real-time data access and audience sharing into the external networks and audience matching with email, Facebook, UID, and MAC address to allow you to create external audiences and monetize these for long after a single user connects to a hotspot. Because you get all kinds of great analytics and data, you can also monetize that data that you're collecting. You can track new versus returning users, see everything in a real-time dashboard. You can even grab walk-by proximity analytics of who is in and around an access point, almost like a heat map. You can view social insights on Facebook and even get all this data via real-time webhook. Once you capture and match all of this data, such as the name, email, gender, birthday, the age, the likes, the friends list, the MAC address, device type, OS type, I mean, the list goes on of the data that you can capture. Think about the advertisers that would pay you for this data. And when it comes to monetization opportunities, you can monetize this in multiple ways. Banner ads on the homepage, on the thank you page, you can have your own interstitial, portrait video, or app carousels, and then a redirect URL that can take you either to a website, an app store, or even a survey. Not only that, you also capture valuable data that allows you to do audience matching and targeting criteria based on MAC address, email, gender, age, interest, events, and frequency. We also seamlessly integrate with an API to custom services. So we can embed this into your existing software as a service with a real-time data feed, a single sign-on login, campaign creation API, widget-based embeds, custom reports, and more, and we can help feed your existing products with data. So why would someone choose My Wi-Fi Networks when it comes to monetizing their Wi-Fi hotspots? Our real competitive differentiation is that we are a 100% white-label captive portal platform. We don't say powered by anything on the bottom. This is completely 100% your brand and your domains. You can use your own domains not only on the captive portal, but also on your dashboard so that the entire experience is branded to you or your client.
We have a full campaign builder with a WYSIWYG editor that makes it very easy to change any element of a campaign in real time. We integrate with your own social apps and over 500 different third-party software integrations. We allow you to manage multiple locations and multiple devices with sub-user access and account limitation. And all of this is packaged up with advanced reporting and data exports so you can easily manage the data that you're capturing. We also have a robust API with flexible integration options that allows you to take this data depending on your application. So how we typically approach custom Wi-Fi solutions is we analyze your problem, we understand exactly how many access points you have and what you're looking to accomplish. We design a custom branded campaign for you or you can give you the access to design everything yourself through our WYSIWYG builders. We'll help you deploy it and integrate it with your cloud controllers and apply our captive portal on your public SSIDs. And then we'll evaluate the campaign to make sure that it's running properly and you're getting the results you want. I'd love to personally speak with you and talk more about Wi-Fi marketing and how it can help your business. Feel free to book a meeting by clicking on the link below. Again, my name is Kevin Zickerman, founder and CEO of My Wi-Fi Networks, and I look forward to speaking with you soon. Thanks for watching.